first responders training like lives depend on it. Several agencies in Ada County participated in a full scale disaster simulation this morning on a runway just south of the Boise Airport. While it is only a drill, it sure looks like the real thing. The simulation involved an in-flight emergency and eventually a plane losing control on the runway. Our Jake Garcia was there. An emergency simulation at the Boise Airport allowing nearly a dozen local agencies to fine tune their response. The scenario, an inbound flight to the Boise Airport while attempting to land has problems with the landing gear, causing the plane to lose control and catch fire on the runway. <laughs> nearly 50 community volunteers acting as injured passengers. When first responders arrive, some already evacuated from the plane, others still inside. The training exercise required every three years by the FAA. And it allows the Boise Airport, along with a number of our community partners, to test our emergency preparedness. Agencies involved include Boise Fire and Police, the National Guard, local hospitals, and Ada County Emergency Management. As part of the simulation, local first responders got hands-on experience triaging and treating patients here on the tarmac. Not only does this exercise provide training, it also prepares emergency officials for the real deal. Everything went as expected, and then afterwards, each agency will get together and take a look at how the actual scenario worked out, and they'll look at things that they did well, things that they can, and things that can be approved upon in the future. In Boise, Jake Garcia, Idaho News 6.